Hello and welcome back to Simply Solo Playthroughs. We are here once again with Harsh Shadows. And as part of our 30 hours of gaming challenge to stop soldier suicide, there is a link down in the bottom. Uh, please consider donating as we try and uh, cut back on soldier suicide, which is a really uh, huge problem. Uh, I've known people. I've had friends. I've had members of my unit um, do that and um, it's very discouraging so uh, we're here with harsh shadows a game by rachel bruner all right it's very simple kind of game all you have to do in this game is you are the spy catcher and you are after the spy and we're going to go around to these nine areas, and we will go on ahead, and uh, we get to have clues as we go, find out what's going to happen. There are four bombs within the Discovery deck. Uh, there is one currently out on the board right now, and we know this. Uh, we do have a diffusing kit, we have a tracking bug, and that's our timer for the end of the game. So, we have three items of evidence. We have to have all three items of evidence. There are four false leads and one red herring. We, we can have the false leads in our hand at the end of the game, but we cannot have the red herring. So, sometimes you have to things up and you'll get rid of the discovery item that's in your hand when the spy lands on you. Yeah, when the spy lands onto your card, or when you encounter a bomb, and you're out of bomb diffusing. So, we move first. We'll move to Sunrise Park. And we, oh, that's nice. I like that right off the bat. So, the first thing we're going to get is we're going to be able to look at two clues. Because we have two points, one point, two points, and three or one. So, we're going to look at these two first. We have the phone and coded message. This is good to know. Spy moves based on a set of cards that are... Uh, you'll see how this works. So I am going to have the cards like this, and then I'm going to turn them like this. Spy cannot move that way, so they can move down. We add a second piece of clue. And that's the end of the spy's turn, our turn. We have already used that. We will move to the cafe. We have photographs. Not one of these, so could be here, could be here, could be there. We don't know. Spy moves. Down to the left or down to the right. And down to the right is the Royal Library. The library gets a second clue. We will move over here to the Rizzo Hotel. And we have coded message. Now we have this, so if we run into the bomb or he comes on to us, we're, we're okay. Spy moves. Back up to the casino. There are already two clues there. We're not going to put another clue. Um, darn. Ah, we'll move here to the Spring Carnival. Uh, the reason for this is if the spy moves up here, we're okay. We don't have to do anything. Phone. So we have both of the false leads that we already have. This is good so far. Spy is going to move. Back down. There's only one, so we put in a second. And, hello Claire, how are you? That's Claire. Hi Claire. She definitely enjoys my gaming table. Okay, so we're now kind of at an impasse. Uh, Keep in mind, we're at one-third chance of going in either way. 
Uh, they only move diagonally. Okay, so we're going to go on ahead and... Hello, Claire. And we're going to go on ahead and move down. And we will activate this card. They can only move diagonally, so we're okay. We get to have a discovery. We get another piece of information. Binoculars. Hey, can I move this, please? Thank you. I kind of wish she was on camera right now because she's really kind of cute. Yes, I'm talking about you. I'm not talking smack, so don't worry. Okay, so it's the spy's turn. They can only move diagonally. There's only one way they can move. They will add in a second one here. I will move to the Uptown Post Office. During the spy's next turn, they can only move up or down. Flip this card. Hmm. That is really tempting. We get a fourth clue. So this is out. Laptop. So good news, we know all four false leads. And the spy, and we are going to activate. Join the spy's next turn. They only move up or down. Flip this card. So let's see which way they move. They will move up. But that's actually what I was really hoping for. We will move over to the Royal Library. And we get a clue. This clue card is gone. Ugh. Sorry, Claire. And we have this one. But we're going to hang on to this because we need to have two points to discover. Activate during this turn. Confiscate items. Each cost one less to reveal. Down to a minimum of one. Flip this card. I'm actually going to do that. And the reason I'm doing that is because... Ooh, photograph. So we've got one. The reason I am doing that is because I want to reveal red herring. And I only want to have to spend one point. Okay. Spice turn. Down to the right. Put in a discovery card. And the discovery deck acts as a timer. And I haven't run into a bomb yet. If the spy moves to this, okay. So, I'm going to move here, right? I need to really activate the tracking beacon, which is off camera, of course. So I really need to activate the tracking beacon. The reason I need to activate the tracking beacon is that way I'll be able to tr use it one time to look and see where he's going to next. And that's really helpful for the end game. So we are going to... We're going to stay out of danger and move to the casino. We get another clue. And the red herring is the hidden camera. Okay, so we have our information out. I, clues really don't matter at this point. Because uh, everything that's left is evidence. Spy's turn. Can't move that way, but can move. This way will take us another discovery card. We will move up to the Riso. When while rotated adjacent. Oh, there we go. That's the one I'm looking for. We will move here. We will take this. We have another clue. I'm not too worried about it. And we will go on ahead and rotate this so the spy has to move there. And we will leave a tracking device. So if the spy goes there, we're kind of forcing him to go there, uh, which is kind of nice, especially right now. 
move down or up by one. We can't add in a second clear. We cannot add in a, a third discovery card. That kind of slows that game down a little bit, so that's good news. We also, as far as good news goes, is we know where he's moving to next. So we don't have to worry about it too much. And we will move to the Sunrise Park. We get the binoculars. I'm really worried we haven't run into any bombs yet. Uh, not, code of message, binoculars, phone. And photographs, which we already have. And the spy is required to move here. The tracking is now on. And we add another discovery. We flip the card over. We move down to... <laughs> That's a bomb. Okay, so I'm not going to go there. And we find a bomb. We will go on ahead and we will just use the phone to get rid of the bomb. So next, the spy gets to move. Well, we only have five cards left. Hello, Claire. You are being very affectionate today and wanting lots of attention. Come here. Up. Oh. I know. I know. It's the end of the world. Hi. Hi, I'm Claire. Okay, so we will shuffle. Okay, that was a little bit of a mistake, and the spy moves down by one. I know this is a, I'm almost positive that's a bomb. Could be here. So let's move here. We get a second clue. We will go on ahead and turn this over. We find it's the passport. Not that it really makes a difference. Spy moves. Back up. Gets another discovery card. We will move. Here. Not a bomb, but a hidden camera. So the good news is we have to get rid of this. Spy moves down to Sunrise Park. We will move up to here and get a passport. Spy moves up by one. Okay, now I know this is a bomb for sure. And the problem I have is I've got a one-third chance of running into, running into the spy. That's not necessarily bad. We're going to move here, and we take a gun. That's our third item right here. So we have... <laughs> we have everything. Oh, this is nice. And the spy moves down, hidden camera out, and we present with the evidence, and it matches. So, this is a nice little win. Thank you for coming. I hope you will like and subscribe to Simply Solo Playthroughs. And don't forget the 30 hours of gaming to stop soldier suicide. I hope you have a really great day. Please like and subscribe.